seems kind of anticlimactic. I mean, you go through, you fight all these things, then you come out and... And yeah, it's, it's worth fighting for. You got a clean land, you got clear skies, a very minimal amount of death evil, compared to, comparatively, I mean. And yet it's still kind of men now. I mean, I've closed something like 16, I think. 16 or 17 now. They're all the same dungeon. It's all... It all kind of blends together, if that makes sense. We can go talk to Joffrey to report our success in defending the city. Hope that there's nothing awful happening in Cloud Ruler Temple now. Because it occurs to me that now will be the perfect time to launch an assault, you know. The champion's away, they're doing whatever it is they're doing. And while I'm away, they go attack Cloud Ruler Temple and, you know, take part in or do whatever. sword. Kind of there. Have you helped Captain Bird and his men close the Oblivion Gate yet? Good news there. Good work. Captain Bird and his guardsmen should be able to handle any additional gates, at least for now. But the Bruma Guard cannot defend the city indefinitely. The Daedra of Oblivion are innumerable. The guardsmen of Bruma are not. We need to gather what allies we can before Bruma is hopelessly besieged. If the Mythic Dawn manages to open a great gate here, the city will need a stronger garrison for there to be any hope of defending it. You should speak to the rulers of the other cities of Cyrodiil, as well as the Elder Council. Ask them to send aid to Bruma before it is too late. Okay. Talk to the leaders of the cities, talk to the... What, what's the Elder Council? Council? What, what else can I do to help? Martin made some progress on the Mysterium Xarxes while you were gone. You should speak to him about it. You know, you should I think speak to the rulers of Cyrodiil as soon as possible. The I figured out another item needed for the ritual to open the portal to Cameron's Paradise. Do tell. The second item is the counterpart to the first, the oh. blood of a divine. This was a terrible puzzle to me. Unlike the Daedra Lords, the gods have no artifacts and do not physically manifest themselves in our world. Plus, they're kind of pissed at me. How, then, to obtain the blood of a god? But Joffrey solved it. The blood of Tiber Septum himself, who became one of the divines. <laughs> this is a secret remembered only by the blades, passed down from one Grand Master to the next. Joffrey should tell it to you himself. I, I'm, I'm not a Grandmaster, I don't think. Be sure to speak to Joffrey about the armor of Tiber Septim. Oh, it's an I'll armor. I'll continue okay, my no, study of the Mysterium Joffrey, 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 no. Gosh dang it. Joffrey. So, Martin wants you to recover the armor of Tiber Septim. I wish there was another way. Oh? The armor is in the shrine of Tiber Septim, in the catacombs beneath the ruins of Sanka Tor, a holy place once. But Sanka Tor became evil long ago. No one has returned from the Shrine of Tiber Septim for many lifetimes. So what kind of evil? I do not know. The catacombs of Sankator were sealed by the first Grand Master of the Blades. The four mightiest blades of Tiber Septim's day, Elaine, Valdemar, Relus, and Kaznar, went to Sankator and never returned. Here, this is the key to Sankator's outer door. I fear I am sending you to your death, but we have no other choice. You must succeed. So what you're saying is, you're sending me alone to a tomb that killed four other guys. Four of the guys who presumably were just as powerful as me. That seems like a good idea. What's, what's this armor look like? An ancient relic of the first emperor who became the divine Talos, the patron of our order. After the Battle of Sankator, 
Tiber Septim gave his armor to the Blades in honor of our role in his victory. The Blades built a shrine in the catacombs of Sankator, on the spot where Tiber Septim received the blessing of Akatosh. The armor has been there ever since. Before evil came to Sankator, this shrine was a place of pilgrimage for all Blades. But no one has visited the shrine and lived to tell the tale in centuries. Okay. May Talos guide you. So where is Sankator? Oh, I've been there. So here's the plan. I'm going to waive the restriction on fast travel just this once. Because I am not going on this giant loop around Cyrodiil just to say, hey, please help us. So we're just going to say, hey, let's go there. Which is, of course, the cue for the game to crash. Who are you? I'm guessing more calipers. Why? <clears throat> Why more calipers? I'm guessing it's mostly going to be undead in here then. I found the interesting catacombs. So I should. I should. <laughs>
is the most important most important and pressing question, I suppose. My three companions and I were sent here by the Emperor Tiber's Septum to discover what evil had defined the holy catacombs of San Contour. We did not know that the Underking, who was here an artist, had risen to take his first revenge upon his former lord. The Under King defeated and ensnared us in his evil enchantment and bound us here to guard forever the defiled shrine of Tiber Septum. You know, I'd appreciate some context there. Who's the Under King? Um, oh yeah. Let's ask, who are you? You're, you're realists. I was Realus, loyal blade of Emperor Tiber Septim. I do not know how long I have been dead. It feels like an eternity. Pretty darn close, too. Is the Under King still here? No. He departed long ago. But his evil will remain, you know, preventing any from paying homage at the shrine sentences. of Tiber Septum. Over the uncounted years of our slavery here, we have brooded over our defeat. I believe that we can undo the Underking. Again with the heavy. I go now to complete my duty to my lord, Tiber Septon. Free my brothers, and together we may be able to lift the Under King's curse. Farewell. Farewell. Please don't tell me your your, your, your friends are going to do the same thing.
look, are these like some kind of alarm pillars? No? See if I can't put a, a drain match here on the back of this thing. to it, it's just calibers, it doesn't matter. Yeah, if I hadn't leveled up so much, these guys wouldn't be so tough, they wouldn't need so much punching. Now these are some pretty miserable jail cells. Which is, I suppose, the point of it, so... That must have been Prisoner Deluxe, you know, get a bad anvil. Fire, because you're 
your skeletons. It's, it's too much to. Uh, I'm gonna put you all through that on on camera. Was there a way out? I missed. Nope. It really is just you know walk, run back through it. Which is something that Oblivion did, did did improve upon in past games, but it's still first. Ah, so that's another door. Not this one, but uh, this one I think. Thing when you can outrun your problems. Yes. Don't 
uncovered. Jerk bag. They've got to find the shrine. That moving, okay. Which begs the question. Okay, that's how I got it. That's how I get out. Miss, miss that giant door. This looks vaguely shiny. You know, you're missing a guy. Come on in, we got we saved a spot for you. You may, may, you may resume your eternal vigil or whatever. We have fulfilled our last duty. We go now to Aetherius without shame. Farewell. Farewell. Hi. 
here's the door we came in. I figure since we're close to the temple now anyway, we might as well go there and drop things off and make a day of it. Oh right, I remember this place. I actually came here earlier in my playthrough and had a had a really tough time fighting against fighting against all the all the liches that were in the in the outside. Who have not responded, thank goodness. Hey, Martin, I got a present for ya. Hail! Good evening, sir. What do you need, friend? My progress on the Mysterium Xarxes is slow, I'm afraid. How goes your search for the armor of Tiber Septim? Here you go. Wait, just a minute. I'll be right Good back. Good luck, my let me, friend. Let me, let me get, let me get back to you on that. Unnecessary. My progress on them still. Here you go. The septim blood may flow through my veins, but you have the soul of a hero. The armor of Tiber Septim himself. Joffrey will be amazed to see it. You can reassure Joffrey that I will not destroy the armor. Oh, good. All I need is a scraping of Talos's divine blood. The blades are as touchy as priests about relics of Tiber Septim, it seems. <laughs> you would know you're a priest. What else can I do? While you were gone, I've made some progress in deciphering the Mysterium Xarxes ritual. The third item we need is a great Welkin stone. You may have run across lesser Welkin stones. They're fairly common in alien ruins. But a great Welkin stone will not be easy to come by. Oh, what's the difference? They have been plundered one by one over the years due to their great value to mages and occultists. There is only one place that is rumored to still contain one. The ruins of the Aeliad city of Miskarkand. A place where many have that. perished seeking its great stone. But nothing else will do, so you must succeed where all others have failed. Huh. I think I've been there, but tell me about them just in case. The capital of one of the ancient Aeliad kingdoms which flourished in Cyrodiil before the rise of men. It is said that the ruins are still haunted by the vengeful spirit of its last king. True or not, it is not a place to enter lightly. Be careful. All right, what's a, what's a great Welkin stone look like? The pinnacle of Aeliad magic. Once, every Aeliad city had its great stone, but they've all been plundered over the centuries. All but one, the great stone of Miskarkand, is reputed still to shine in the deep darkness of its ruined halls. But no one has ever done more than glimpse it from a distance. It is said to be guarded by the ghost of the last king of Miskarkand. Okay. Be Do careful, my friend. I think I, think I know you've braved crash. many dangers already. Yeah, somewhere near Kavach. I remember that. That place is full of undead, and I remember that was, that was the first time I ever I ever encountered something that was back during the back during the early days of this playthrough. You know, before I was actually recording it, when I was still using the tried and tested cast and then run away method of killing things, 
and that introduced me to Dread Zombies and their ability to basically wipe out your mana regeneration. It was a terrible thing. So here's the plan. Let's go but Miss to Bruma. Hopefully we don't crash on entering. Is not to be taken lightly. See, that's an auto save, so we should be good to fast travel real quick. And if it crashes, oh well. <laughs> Castle Bruma. Work. Hey, we're good. What's this I hear about me getting a giant statue? that happen later on? Welcome uh, back, my lord. I've never seen my lady so happy. You've done well. Ah, uh, right, because I got her that ring. She holds public audience in the Great Hall on weekday mornings. If you need to speak to her, that's the time to do it. Safe journey, my lord. at least. Oh. That'd be why, because I'm too early. Oh! Also, good news. You might be hearing my keyboard more in the background, and that's because for the longest time, I've been... I've... Uh, the keyboard wasn't working properly. A bunch of keys weren't working, so I sent it away to get replaced. Good it's to back. see you again. Good to see you again. Are you not the person I talked to? Some see only the conflicts between northern and southern cultures, but I see the way they are stronger when woven together. Um. What? Me? Uh, you aren't the person I'm supposed to talk to, right? Luck be always on oh, your what side. I, what am I doing? I don't need to convince you to, to defend Ruma because you're already going to do it anyway. So let's go talk to the other rulers. Hopefully we can do it quickly before the end of the episode. Hi there. Okay, Choro, Coral. Coral, Choro. I'm going to say Coral because that's how, I've, that's, how I've been, that's how I've been pronouncing it. Hello. Countess. It is quite nice to see you again. I hope you are faring well. Yes, it's been quite a while since I helped you with that painting thing. You want, can I call in a favor? While I understand Bruma's need, Coral's own defense must come first. I cannot spare any soldiers as long as Coral remains under threat from the Oblivion Gate You're outside our walls. It's about that stolen painting. The painting of the Count once again sits in its rightful place. Wonderful. So, you wanna... Gosh dang it. Farewell. Fine. I'll fix your problem for you. How do you do? Okay, it's out that gate. Wonderful. Wonderful. This is not to have all.
again, we're just going to run through and grab that stone. I am not nearly rested enough. I've been running around, running all the way across across Cyrodiil to get you to answer, answer your calls. You can't even offer me a nice favor for a couple of months. Selfish pricks in every single bit of how much more this is going to happen in all the other halls as well. not be the most the best the best quality content to just run past all these guys, but the garment is 